Hey guys, it's Madame Moria. Welcome back to New Pimp in Animal Crossing City Folk. Today we're getting to know the neighbors and I have a couple things to catch you guys up on. Um, as I said yesterday, our neighbors really don't have... What? Who in the world? Pickles! Wherever could she have gone? Little darling naughty kitten. What? Oh, she's always been such a willful kitten. Oh, Pickles, what's a mama cat to do? I wonder if she's a pop star. <laughs> what? Slim, I need your town, like, now. Um, oh, I guess I didn't introduce her. I guess this is Caitlyn. Um, and I guess she lost her kitten because she's a really terrible parent. Um. That or Slim stole her kitten because he's just a weirdo like that. Um, so yeah, anyway, yesterday I promised that we would kind of give the animals a better character for themselves um, because we haven't really talked to them as much as we should have by now. Aw, he put... Hey, didn't I give this to you? I gave you the stupid bug rolled. Nice one, Wonder M. Sweet hiding spot you got staked out here. What are you talking about? You gotta help me out. I need help in a bad way. Oh. Um, I've got a package that has to be delivered. Yeah, I don't want to deliver your bad package to some chick, Rold. Come on. Alright, leave it to me. Yes, you're a huge help. Rowan? Ew. Goodness. He needs it done by five. Do I look like I have... Why am I on this schedule now? Okay, well, I guess Rald's not going to talk to us right now because if he does, it'll be nothing but, Ooh, did you deliver my package yet? I really need to get it rolling. Um, so, yeah. Alrighty! Uh, so I have some information that is really irritating. Um, but at the same time, kind of hilarious in a sucky way. Um, so first of all, here is Rosie's house. As we noticed yesterday, Rosie has the halo she bought, er, no, the halo I gave her, the um, pacifier she bought from me, the bathtub we need for our house, so I'm gonna have to send her letters with furniture, and no country guitar, so, okay. Um, so anyway, I had a couple friends over last night, and we were just looking around and like, um, the trees, and in the recycling bin, guess what we found? What was it doing in the recycling bin? Why would she buy my country guitar for a thousand bells and then throw it in the recycling bin? You jerk! You're two-faced! I was like, what? You've got to be kidding me! She tried to recycle my country guitar! The prize I got for turning in such a pimp bug at the bug off. And she throws it in the recycling? What is the point of that? That was the dumbest thing she could have done. So anyway, um, yeah, I, I really, I, I don't even know what to say to Rosie right now. First she like dates Rowan or whatever and now she's gonna buy my country guitar so she can recycle it? What kind of logic is this? Oh, well, luckily, I got it back. You doof. Punch. I'd punch you if I could. I know. I do like Rosie, but what kind of a stupid move was that? That was just dumb. Um, are you going to talk about anything else? Oh, come on! You don't need to talk about this mom anymore. But anyway, I think we did learn a little bit about Rosie's personality. Who knows what she's plotting against us right now. Um, so anyway, I've been saying, like, Rald's, like, our best friend, because he kind of is. Uh, we always talk to Rald. He's probably my favorite in the town, actually, because, like, um, well, he's also the first person we met, but his personality's just so funny, and he lost his key again last night. Ooh, a fruit room! This is just, like, my house in Hogwarts, um, 
because it was like citrus and fruit themed. Sup, chick? Dude, just kidding. Make yourself comfortable, mi casa es su casa! Mm -hmm. What, so you're Spanish now? When did this happen? I gotta say, it's pretty cool how you design your own clothes. Aww. Well, thank you. What? Design me a shirt with a picture of the yogurt parfait? Interesting. Don't try to walk into me. Do you think that wearing an outfit with a picture of yogurt parfait on it makes it taste even better? Clyde is a freak! Alright, I, I don't know what to think about this. Clyde is kind of scaring me. Um. Okay. Wait, was that my hand? Oh, I guess it was. Oh, Rowan. Not in again, and neither is Lucy. Mm. What? Neither is Tiffany. Who I wanted to talk about because yesterday I got a lot of comments that were Tiffany almost got hit by that bus. You know what that reminds me of? In Mean Girls when, um... It's kind of towards the end, and Katie's talking to Regina, and she gets hit by that bus. <laughs> They're like, and that's how Regina George died. Oh my god, seriously? Tiffany is like the next Regina, and not even on purpose. Like, it's crazy. And then people, you guys commented about that. And then some of you caught that Mean Girls reference too, and commented about that. So I was like, hmm... I think you guys are maybe asking for another Mean Girls tribute. Don't know if I'm gonna do that or if we should do an entirely different movie, but um, that would be pretty cool if we had a movie um, as part of one of the episodes like last year. And where is Rowan? That's who I need to find right now. Um, which we're not finding him, apparently, because we're going in Peanut's house. Oh! Hi, Peanut. Yay, Wonder Am. So, how have you been, chaps? Why do you say chaps? What did you want? I need a... I'm not giving you the stupid left wing. Talk about something more interesting than your popularity. Let's talk. Did you hear the news? More fake stuff was found at Red's shop. Oh, he's so totally sketchy. Oh, I know, Peanut. Let's talk again. There aren't many big events. Whatever, 4th of July is like right around the corner. My favorite holiday. Oh, my friend Gaia. Yay. Yes, Gaia was here. And no, I'm not giving you her friend code, so don't ask. I got this total waterlog sort of feel from that kid. Okay. That makes sense. No. She's the cat son, not a water log, weirdo. Alright, so, um, Peanut's kind of stupid. I'm just gonna put that out there. Let's go. <laughs> oh, and if his light's on, I guess we'll visit the Dark Lord. Uh, I still can't believe Rosie tried to recycle my country guitar. What kind of person does that? What is this? I have been finding these all over the place. A bow toyed. Is that what I already have? Like the one with the little bow on its head? I don't know if that's it or not. I guess we can go in my house later as soon as we find Rowan and talk to more people because no one down here is home except for Peanut. Um. So yeah, last year I was totally like dating Cody. And then he turned out to be a freak. And, um... Well, I guess I could have kept that because I could have sold it at Luke's, but whatever. Then, um... You know, that was kind of just like he became a creeper. We still sort of liked him, but not really. Um, we had Fierce Pierce, who was the, like, awesome gay dude of the town. And... What is- no, that's dumb! Whatever, I'll plant it in front of Tiffany. Why is my mic falling off my ear? Okay. I'm good. Maybe. There you are! Finally! Hey, talk to us. Hey chaps, what's the haps wonder in? Let's- what? Oh. To Rowan. Here's your sweet gift from Rald. 
What? From Rold? What do I do? Dude, I remember the last time that kid sent me something. It's a caladium. Oh. Uh, what is that? I don't even know what that is. Alrighty. Well, I guess Rowan got his gift. Wait, let's talk to him more. What am I doing? Oh man, was that close, Wonder Am. I almost forgot to ask you something. Hey, you ever seen a vi- Of course you'd want me to do some favor for you. Go grab your violin beetle. Um, so violin beetles, I think they're the ones that um, appear on stumps. So leave a couple stumps in your town. Uh, there's another kind of beetle that's on a stump, I believe, as well, but whatever. Oh, so he was thinking some majorly deep thoughts. Mm, now I'm out for a power walk. He's all like, he's like Buzz, except he doesn't have the um, deep voice, and we kind of dated him until he cheated on us. Um, how many girlfriends does he have, though? Because he talks about Lucy and Rosie. What are you talking about, my pink glasses? My pink glasses? You like my pink glasses? Alright. It's been like forever since we had a big event. Whatever! That's what Peanut just said. Is Peanut your girlfriend too? Jeez, he's pulling like a John Tucker over here. Talk to me! It's been like forever since the big event. Okay, cool. Way to repeat yourself. You know what I don't like? When you repeat yourself with a stupid thing you said. Who have we not talked to? Roscoe? Tiffany? I have no idea where they are. What's up, Popper? Um, well, I'll be. Aren't you brave walking right into the... Um, considering we have, like, a tiger in town... You're dumb. Anyway, take a close look. See, I love his deep voice. I guess he's more like Buzz, because... Well, I don't know. He's more like, um... Roscoe. Wait, is that- no. Rizo. Rizo, that's it. Okay, he's more like Rizo from Pimp Hood. Cause like, Rizo was the dude who was kind of a, like, jerk. But a likable jerk. But not as likable as Buzz. But he had like the deep voice. Oh my god, let's talk about fossils some more! It wasn't clear to me treasure means fossils. Stop! I don't want to talk about fossils! Mr. Rock? Doof? I don't know. So yeah, um... Let's see, yeah. Rowan is like the player. Kinda like Buzz, and then, um... Where are you going? She looks like she works at Starbucks with this, like, apron on. Anyway, um... And then Hopper's like Rizzo. Sort of a likable jerk. Um, let's see, Peanut's kind of dumb. I don't know if she's dumb enough to get stuck in a tree like Blue Bear, because I believe there's no one dumber than Blue Bear, but I still love Blue Bear. How many times did I say Blue Bear in that sentence? What's the matter? Delivery done! Alright. Sweet, I always wanted some bamboo flooring. Because it totally matches my house. No, I, oh well. Come on, let's talk about something else! Okay, I guess not. I guess we'll go look for people, and if we don't find anybody, we will talk to those people in the next episode. Um. Alright. So, where to? Where do we go? Nobody knows. I need to dig up the spot. Do, 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 do. Okay. And it's a gargoyle. Does that mean it's a gargoyle? I like gargoyles. There's. She's over at like the bus stop again, and she's trying to talk to us. Okay, get ready for a thrill. I brought the perfect rally shirt for you. It's only four. I'm not. Ta no! I'm not paying you. What? But why? Yes, yes. I guess I didn't make it clear that I have only the best intentions here. Whatever, you do not. Everybody knows that you're a jerk. Wait, 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 wait. Let's plant this hole in front of her. No, she's walking the other way! Okay, hold on. We gotta push her into the pitfall. Doodly doodly doo. And... 
berry. Alright, let's do this. No, I, we don't need to do that. I wonder... I've heard what could happen. No, no, no. Don't you go... Don't go this way. Go this way. Now go up. Up. Up a little more. There! Now that's perfect. Now stay there. Dude, you're walking the other way! The bus won't come if someone's standing in the room. Whatever. Come this way. I need you to fall into this hole. Come on, Tiffany! You know you want to. We're getting there. Didn't I make Monique fall into a hole last year or was it Blue Bear? Stop getting all dizzy and crap. Oh! Oh my god, we accomplished something! <laughs> what? Don't look at me, this is so embarrassing! <laughs> oh no, she's very steamed. I didn't want to talk to her! I've had enough, just leave me alone! Oh, is her eye all beat up? That's so sad! Aww. I do feel bad for her. It's like animal cruelty. I know, people are like, don't feel bad for me. How'd you get all the way over here? Don't feel bad for Mo Monique, but I feel bad that she was hurt. What was that? You're I don't want to catch you this violin beetle. You don't even know how to play a violin beetle. Thank goodness you're here, Wonder M. There's something I wanted to talk to you about. Oh my god. Oh. Do you think maybe you could dig up a fossil for me? Okay. Too bad, I already... Oh. Well, maybe this is one right here. Maybe. Maybe. Where's Roscoe? And did they just change clothes over there? See? He's totally trying to get a cheap feel. He gives her clothes so we can... I'm not even going to. Wait, he's got a new outfit on. What is this? Look at this, like, at he's prancing around... Fine. Yeah, maybe he did have a gay relationship with Rodeo. Anyway, we've got to get this fossil identified because I am going over time. I meant to go to like 15 minutes and it's like not 15 minutes right now. Check a fossil. Oh my god, you've got a marvelous fossil. Hopefully it's a repeat. If not, we'll just end the episode here. I mean, if it is... Oh yeah. I guess that is what I was going to. Okay, good! That is what's I, what I still can't... Oh my god, I can't talk. That is what I was going to do. Okay, shut up. Let's go. Hopefully she's still standing out here. I know all these videos have turned out to be like 20 minutes. And I keep talking about it like I, it's a bad thing. It really isn't a bad thing. It's just like... I don't know. I feel like it's a long time. Alright, fossil! So I guess we'll get to know Roscoe more tomorrow as well as everybody else. I knew you would remember the promise you made. Aw, oh, thank you for the ranch wall. I know, I'm gonna get like 20 comments through like, you could have sold that for like 10,000 bills. But I really don't care. We gotta be nice to the neighbors, kind of. Alright guys, well this has been Madame Wario. I will see you all tomorrow.